Welcome to the short presentation of the user interface of the PWIC open source web analytics software. Um, today we're going to look at how this user interface is looking like and what are the basic features. Uh, what I've done now is actually logging into the PWIC uh, analytics uh, page where you can actually see the actual analytics. Uh, the UI that I'm looking at is PWIC 0.8 and was launched late uh, July here in 2010. Um, and when you log in, uh, you initially get to the uh, dashboard where you, just like in Google Analytics, can see a lot of the kind of main uh, data for your website. Uh, you can see some last visit trends. You can see how the average length of the different visits has been. You can see which keyword on different search engine has been uh, providing hits for your site. You can see which of the best search engine. You can see visits by server time. There's also a possibility to see which countries uh, are the most popular uh, for your site, which external uh, websites has provided traffic, which are the most popular pages on your site, and very interesting features. Uh, a live visitor uh, log where you can actually see where the, um, the last visitors from the site has been coming from and what they've been doing on the site. Go to the next tab, you can go a little further into different visitor metrics. You can get an overview, you can see an engagement, how the visitors has been interacting with your site, you can see where the visitors has been coming from, a log. Uh, Again, this is a real-time statistic that says uh, I'll display some data about the last visitors and where they've been coming from, what they've been doing in the site, and then some additional information on which kind of plugins they have uh, available in the browser. It can be very useful for again optimizing your site and see what people are doing on the site. You can get some statistics on where, uh, on, on which time of the day the visitors are. Looking at the site, you can have some action data saying what are the most important pages, where are people starting on your site, where are people leaving your site, um, which external sites are people leaving for. Uh, to track external links, you need to modify the tags a little, but uh, that's pretty easy to do. And if you have some kind of download possibility on your site, you can also get um, some statistics on how many downloads you've had. Last but not least, you also have some referral statistics where you can see kind of an overall evolution in the referrals. You can see referrals by search engine and keywords by websites, or if you're having some kind of campaigns like banner campaigns, affiliate campaigns, uh, Google AdWords campaigns, you can also track that in P Week. Uh, so that's kind of the short introduction to the P Week UI. Uh, if you want to know more about P Week, I recommend that you go to the website tips for php net and look for the article or post that we have there about that goes into further depth uh, with the possibilities with PeeWeek. Thank you for watching.